guys, my name is Anna. Welcome back to Hickville Productions. I'm playing another indie game from Game Jolt. Uh, it's free. You can find a link down in the description if you want to check it out. This one was done by a game dev who I believe is currently still in school from the side of things because this was a project done from a class. Going by the description because um, they were apologizing because there's a few glitchy things as far as like the hitboxes and stuff like that. Um... But I'm pretty sure it's supposed to be a puzzle platformer. It looks kind of cool. The art style appeals to me. So I thought I would take a peek at it. Uh, so let's see here. I understand how painful this is for you. But you need to give me an answer. It's the right thing to do. For her sake and yours. I was not expecting something starting like this. That's for sure. Ah, oh, so artsy. Nice pixel art. Whee! Okay. Controls aren't too bad. They, they stick a little bit, but... There's like a, a, a tad delay, maybe? I, I don't know. Something doesn't feel quite right. I'm gonna guess that goes there. Okay. The color palette kind of has a... Almost like Japanese culture feel to it for some reason reason. I don't know. Maybe it's just white and red. <laughs> and, like, there's a red dot, so it reminds me of, like, the Japanese flag. Um... Do, do I have... Oh, I... I okay. Duh. Double jump. Come on. I grew up on platformers. I should know better. Can I, like, duck down to grab the chain? What, what do I gotta do? Wait! Oh, no. We just run over to the next spot. Okay. Alright. Instinct got us through that one. Not even lying, I jumped without thinking and I double jumped on instinct. Like pure reflex. Whee! Yeah, this is cool. Not bad so far. Oh, great. I hate jumps like this. Ooh, I did it. Okay. And up. And up. But, um. Oh, I just noticed. There's like a. Very obvious vignette all of a sudden. <laughs> but. I like the use of the very limited, like, color palette. They're pretty much just sticking with your grays, which are all taken just slightly in the red hue. Um, if you look closely, all the grays have a slight tint of red to them. And then you just have, like, that one red color that just really pops out against all the other shades. Spikes! Probably shouldn't run into those head first. But, ugh! Oh. Hey, no! <laughs> Is this one of those hitbox issues? Or am I just really bad at this? Oh! Oh, I can wall jump! I can wall jump! I can wall jump! Whee! That's cool! Alright! I like it, because I can just kind of get absorbed in the environment while still wondering what that conversation was in the beginning. Alright, I'm going to get to go down and whoop! It's a little bit of a hitbox weirdness up at the top there, because went a little further out than it should have and there's some weirdness there going on, but okay! We'll compensate. Oh no! Yeah. Yeah. Also, I totally dig like the character design. It's really cute. It's really simple. I can tell I'm a, I'm guessing a girl in a dress of some sort. Or at least some sort of character in a dressy-like thing or a tunic. I have a little red scarf and I have like upside down moose antlers! Oh, right, because this, this could go wrong. Hey, nope. It was... Oh, okay. And little moosey girl wandered down and... Oh my gosh! Impaled her buttocks upon the spike. She then respawned and tried again. This time succeeding. What's this? It's a button. Oh. Oh, I still gotta do... I gotta hoop. I got hoop. And I hoop. And then we hoop. And then we hoop. And then we hoop. Like that. Whoa, that really shook the screen. Okay. Whee. This is sweet. I feel like this just turned from, like, peaceful, sweet, into something horrible and ominous going by the music. Uh, which I forgot. Uh, dear. Walking along. Whoa. Well, that's a humanoid monster if I've ever seen one. I am so tiny. Oh my god! What? It's just suddenly I'm on this chain. Okay, um, huh? No! I'm gonna die. Oh 
Okay. What do I do? Oh, 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 oh. Wall, wall jump, wall jump, wall jump, wall jump. Aha. Okay, okay. Now, wait for the chain to swing over. The chain that was hanging off of the shoulders of the monster. Uh, I'm gonna get that wall jump on this one this time. Okay. So I could, I, yeah, I could just. So, yup. But hey, you know, if it's a student project, it was made on a tight deadline for a class, I can forgive it for that. No big. Still very cute. Ah! Nah. Okay, wall jumpy, wall jumpy, wall jumpy, wall jumpy, wall jumpy, wall jumpy! And hoo yeah! Woo! Okay. We got this, guys, we got this. We must see what that thing is that I must confess to that person. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. Those are salad. Okay, great. So, I guess I have to land on the one above me. I did it. I did it. Okay, now I got... Okay, 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 okay. Oh, apparently I made it high enough. <laughs> that felt a little weird. It was a honestly rather challenging level, though. It felt it felt uh, good to play through. Um, okay. Do I go up or do I go down? Oh dear. And then she exploded. It's okay. Can I like wall jump with my head? Like get my my stop my head stick to the ceiling. That would be very useful right about now. Oh wait, what if I can I wall jump off, double jump out, and then yes! Ho oh, ho! Not bad. Whee! And I know I said the controls felt a little funny in the beginning, but uh, I've gotten used to them now, I think. I'm gonna guess we do that again, the whole jumpy, uppy, outy thingy. Ah, uh, okay, I guess I gotta. Go. <laughs> no, I had it for a second! Oh, uh, the thing is, like, you have to hit it just right so that you don't, like, hit your head. Oh, oh, no, no! Oh, huh, huh. Oh, the controls are just not quite tight enough for this! Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh, I did it! I get it! Uh, keep all jumping! No, no, no! Come on! Don't you freaking dare! Don't you freaking dare! You're gonna freaking make it up there! You're gonna- You're gonna make it up the freaking- No! 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 Do you know how long it took me to get up to this point? Do you know how long it took me to get here? Do you know how long it took me to get here? I will destroy my space bar getting up this thing! actually sealed off and I'm supposed to go the other way somehow. I think I'm supposed to go the other way somehow. Okay, there we go. Okay. Okay. Maybe I was doing it wrong the whole time and all that frustration was just my own fault. Yep, that might be the case. There. I did that. Can I go up here? I can. Oh my gosh, this is tall. That's okay. It beats trying to do a jump that I apparently wasn't supposed to do in the first place, because I'm just that awesome. Whee! Alright, now. Eh. There we go. Oh no, what have I done? Oh. Oh! What? Oh, that's creepy! Oh, this got creepy! I mean, it was kind of creepy with the big robot person, but that was even creepier. Oh, nice. The, uh... The mask layer follows you, kind of. Yeah. Oh, no! Is it your 
doing there though with the mask, limiting my field of view. Make oh wait, are these moving? Oh, these are moving. I didn't realize that the first time. Okay. There we go. Wait. Wait till the field is a little narrower and then ha! wall jump! Wall jump! I'm really good at that now. I only spent way longer wall jumping than I should have. Oh, so bad. Oh, this doesn't look fun. I wonder if that's the developer's name down there on that column. Oh, I did it! Birds flying, I'm now on the back of a deer. Okay. A little bit of visual tearing there. Oh! I wasn't ready! Eh! Okay, 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 this is cool. This works. Then we wall jump off of this one, and then we- Oh, we die. Okay. We wall jump, and then we die. Got it. Let's not do that this time. Oh, no, we died again. This is gonna be a pain because these spikes have really messed up hitbox. Okay, okay, there's gotta be like a sweet spot for jumping over. Uh, no, 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 no. Can I just jump and hop again? No, why did you not double jump? And then, huh? No! Oh! <laughs> so close! Come on! Come on! Come on! You can do this! You can do this! You got this! You got this! Oh! If you had missed that platform, I would have been so angry at you, little moose girl! Okay. Uh. Can I just. Yep. Hit. Hit. Okay. <laughs> I don't like this part of the level. I don't know if this is fun anymore. It's still pretty, though. But it's not. Oh, God. In and of itself, it's not horrible if the controls of the hitboxes were really nice and tight, but they're not. So it just it kills it. When the hitboxes aren't tight to the pixel dimensions of the item that they're bound to, it really screws up the experience, especially on a platformer like this. Ah! No! No! Oh gosh, I just took a peek at what's ahead of me. Can I just like squeeze through this little space right here, please? No, oh my gosh, I can't believe I just did that. That was my own dumb fault, and I can't believe I just did that. That was so stupid of me. Why did I do that? Okay, we made it over. Come on, come on, where do I fall? Where do I fall? Where? Oh my god, look how far out I'm standing from the freaking platform! Spikes. Just snow. It's so beautiful. I love it. Ah. It's so relaxing after the last few levels of horrible spikiness. And then there was the sun. That or it was planet Mars. I'm not really sure where we are in space or time. Other than a large black screen, fading into a red and white scene of snow and sorrow. Little Moose Girl looks sad as she dejectedly trudges up the hill of snow. Or is it white fur? Because we are on a deer, last that I knew. Oh no! Someone's dying. Is this like all in the mind of someone on life support? Because that would be an interesting take on the game and on the story. Where all the platforming spikes, like, wouldn't it be kind of interesting? Like, all the jumping around, all the platforming was like a uh, metaphor or simile for like the heart meter that I can't think the name of. <laughs> and I'm dead! And I'm buffing the microphone.
Okay. I'll have to double check, make sure that music is all safe to leave in and that it was uh, royalty free. It was really good, though. Um, anyway, I guess that's the game. And I guess maybe it was about someone on life support and overhearing the conversation about, oh, okay, cool, just close, that's fine. Hearing the conversation about, you know, whether or not someone should pull the plug on her and whatnot. Because, I mean, the description said that it's a minimalistic platformer and there's dark truth at the end. So maybe that was it. I'm not sure. What do you think? Uh, anyway, go check it out. The game wasn't bad by any means. Um, definitely had a few little issues with, like, the hitboxes and stuff, but the devs are already aware of that. Either way, the art style was wonderful, and yeah, that'll do it for this video. Um, that said, thank you very much for watching. I hope you have an excellent day. Go out and share a smile with someone, because you never know who might need it, and give yourself a hug for being awesome, and I hope to see you and all y'all in another video. And until then, later! Is that a dodo egg? I thought a dodo egg! Okay, so. Hi. Oh gosh! <laughs> I was like, oh hey, look, a dodo just walking right up to me, and then all of a sudden. I hate when the spontaneously ominous music starts playing.